Wake up, Warhawks! Today is Tuesday, August 6, 2019, and I'm your host, McKinley Green here with Elizabeth Bunch. Today's production is sponsored by Hawk Sauce, a taste too good to waste. Soon available in the front office. Welcome back to Devil High for the 2019-2020 school year. As we begin to walk the halls today, you'll notice several new teachers and even more old teachers doing new things. Yeah, McKinley, I guess we really are going to see if you can teach an old hawk new tricks. Coach Blake Gardner, the 2019 Dothan Eagle Coach of the Year, had moved his classroom down to the middle school hallway as he takes over Coach Sullivan's spot in 7th and 8th grade history. Coach Desmond Lett will take over the Warhawk football team this year and has returned to our campus as athletic director and weight training instructor. New teachers include Mr. Paul Sloshberg, 7th and 8th grade science, Ms. Carolyn McDaniel, math teacher of many grades, Ms. Sabrina Lewis, 7th and 8th grade English, Coach Scott Parker, 8th and 10th history, Ms. Heather Brooks, 9th and 10th grade math, Mr. Paul Payne, special ed, and SGT Kenneth Petty, ROTC instructor. We'd like to welcome all our new teachers to the field. As the week continues, we'll tell you more about the new teachers on campus. When you visit the front office, you'll notice our new secretary, Ms. Erica Untersayer, taking the place of Ms. Corbett. You'll have a few chances to tell Ms. Corbett goodbye this week. We are expecting her on campus around Thursday to help train our new secretary. Today, during English, students will be given their planner, code of conduct, health forms, and lunch forms. The planner should be used throughout the day as a hall pass and a place to organize your life. Make sure you write your name on it or they'll charge you $4 to get a new one. Code of conduct papers, health forms, and lunch forms can be turned into your homeroom teacher or first period teacher. Nurse Sturgill wants to make sure everyone knows that you have to resubmit your medical paperwork every year. If you need her, she can be found in the nurse's office at the end of the middle school hallway. She will not speak to you unless you have a planner signed by your teacher. Lunch forms must be resubmitted every year. If you need a Spanish version of the form, they are located in the front office. Your old lunch form will be worked until the end of the week, so go ahead and get a new one to turn in. Lockers may be purchased before school, during lunch, during break, and after school. Each locker is $10. Your selected locker has to be the appropriate grade level. Remember students cannot share lockers. The first time you lose your combo, it's free to get a reminder. The second time, it might be free on how set you look. The third time, it will cost you a dollar. Parking passes may be purchased in the front office before school, during lunch, during break, or after school. Each parking pass is $20. Make sure you bring your license and proof of insurance to be put on the file. Parking passes must be purchased by the end of the week. Off-campus lunch forms are available to seniors. The forms can be picked up in homeroom or the front office. Seniors, be sure to return to campus on time so that you do not lose your off-campus lunch privileges. Lunch for today is a Hot Pocket, salad, carrots, fresh apples, and milk. Breakfast for tomorrow is Pop-Tarts, yogurt, strawberries, assortment of cereal, assortment of juice, or milk. Lunch is $2.25 and breakfast is $1.50. Today's high is 91 and the low is 72. Expect to see scattered rain showers throughout the day. Coach Lett will be holding a meeting with prospective varsity and junior varsity football players over the next few days. If you're interested in leading the Warhawks to victory, keep your ear out. Mr. Robertson and Mr. Folsom will continue to call classes to the lunchroom today to go over the code of conduct and dress code. Make sure you're listening for when it's your class's turn to go. Well, that's all for the news today. Hashtag Hawks out! out.